What did we learn on Friday night? On uh, Thursday night when John beat we Melbourne. <laughs> what did we learn? Ah, Jared, contested balls king. I've told yes. you that for many, many years. Um, and it was a terrific effort by the Cats to take on the might of Melbourne in that area and win. What we learn is that Geelong at home are enormous. They were, they played, it's going to sound strange, I described on Saturday morning and there was a really good performance, not a great performance, but a good performance. I still want to see Geelong take their new game style to the MCG and qualifying final, second semi-final, primary final, whatever it is, I can't wait. But I tell you what, they look... They look deep. They look well-drilled, but they've always looked well-drilled. And they move the ball, Jared. Yeah, they're, they're different, scary. aren't they? Yeah, they're and, and you wrote that piece right at the start of the year mm. when Chris Scott Thank spoke you. about bringing the new coaching staff together and blank canvassing it. If we were building this from scratch, what yep. would our approach be? And we're starting to see round 17. They, so they've, mm. um, they've put their plan together. They have honed it. And I think we're just starting to see the pointing yeah, end of it now. Thanks for bringing that up. Because when he said it to me, I thought, that's a really smart thing to do. James Kelly, who else come in? Quickly off the top of your head. James Kelly is one. I mean, Eddie Betts has come in. As development, Harry Taylor. Harry Taylor come back. Righto, on the round table, what have we got? What have we got? But it, that's, it doesn't, he hasn't stuck with that, Jared. It, it's evolved. Mm. Five weeks ago, Tom Atkins was sitting on a half-back flank saying, God, what a little bulldog he is. Now, he's going in the middle against Clayton Oliver and Christian Petrarca and more than holding his own. So there's a lot of tweaks as you go through the season. Sometimes that doesn't work, sometimes that works. This is what we saw on the weekend with the Cats is... Work, 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 work. But footy's on a day-to-day -day basis, yeah, isn't yeah. it? Game-to-game -game basis. And Melbourne have lost four of six, including Fremantle, Sydney and Geelong. So they're a bit of a matter of trust what are you, at the you, moment. No, I, still, trust? I still have trust. But they're not quite the team I thought they were going to be in 2022. They might still end up being that. But they're not quite that team right now. The final... The Magpies are, are clutch. They've won...